you're driving on an open road in dry weather. What should the distance be between you and the vehicle in front? A two second time gap. One car length. Two meters, six feet, six inches. Two car lengths. A two second time gap. What does this sign mean? Ring road. Mini roundabout. No vehicles. Roundabout. Roundabout. What should you do when approaching traffic lights where red and amber are showing together? Pass the lights if the road is clear. Take care because there's a fault with the lights. Wait for the green light. Stop because the lights are changing to red. Wait for the green light. You're driving towards a zebra crossing. A person in a wheelchair is waiting to cross. What should you do? Continue on your way. Wave to the person to cross. Wave to the person to wait. Be prepared to stop. Be prepared to stop. You're following a slower moving vehicle on a narrow country road. There's a junction just ahead on the right. What should you do? Overtake after checking your mirrors and signalling. Only consider overtaking when you're past the junction. Accelerate quickly to pass before the junction. Slow down and prepare to overtake on the left. Only consider overtaking when you're past the junction. You're on a well-lit road at night in a built-up area. How will using dipped headlights help? You can see further along the road. You can go at a much faster speed. You can switch to main beam quickly. You can be easily seen by others. You can be easily seen by others. You've stopped at an incident to give help. What should you do? Keep injured people warm and comfortable. Give injured people something to eat. Keep injured people on the move by walking them around. Give injured people a warm drink. Keep injured people warm and comfortable. You're unsure what a slow-moving motorcyclist ahead of you is going to do. What should you do? Pass on the left. Pass on the right. Stay behind. Move closer. Stay behind. You're the first to arrive at the scene of a crash. What should you do? Leave as soon as another motorist arrives. Flag down other motorists to help you. Drag all casualties away from the vehicles. Call the emergency services promptly. Call the emergency services promptly. You've been involved in an argument that has made you feel angry. What should you do before starting your journey? Open a window. Turn on your radio. Have an alcoholic drink. Calm down. Calm down. You're carrying an 11-year-old child in the back seat of your car. They're under 1.35 metres, 4 feet 5 inches, tall. What must you make sure of? That they sit between two belted people. That they can fasten their own seat belt. That a suitable child restraint is available. That they can see clearly out of the front window. That a suitable child restraint is available. What should you do when overtaking a motorcyclist in strong winds? Pass closely. Pass very slowly. Pass wide. Pass immediately. Pass wide. You intend to turn left from a main road 
into a minor road. What should you do as you approach it? Keep just left of the middle of the road. Keep in the middle of the road. Swing out to the right just before turning. Keep well to the left of the road. Keep well to the left of the road. Following a collision, someone has suffered a burn. The burn needs to be cooled. What's the shortest time it should be cooled for? Five minutes. Ten minutes. Fifteen minutes. Twenty minutes. Ten minutes. Why should you allow extra room when overtaking a motorcyclist on a windy day? The rider may turn off suddenly to get out of the wind. The rider may be blown across in front of you. The rider may stop suddenly. The rider may be travelling faster than normal. The rider may be blown across in front of you. You're looking for somewhere to park your vehicle. The area is full except for spaces marked disabled use. What can you do? You can use these spaces when elsewhere is full. You can park in one of these spaces if you stay with your vehicle. You can use one of the spaces as long as one is kept free. You can't park there unless you're permitted to do so. You can't park there unless you're permitted to do so. What should you do when you leave your car unattended for a few minutes? Leave the engine running. Switch the engine off but leave the key in. Lock it and remove the key. Park near a traffic warden. Lock it and remove the key. You've just passed your practical test. You don't hold a full licence in another category. Within two years, you get six penalty points on your licence. What will you have to do? Retake only your theory test. Retake your theory and practical tests. Retake only your practical test. Reapply for your full licence immediately. Retake your theory and practical tests. Traffic signs giving orders are generally which shape? You're approaching a red traffic light. What will the signal show next? Red and amber. Green alone. Amber alone. Green and amber. Red and amber. You're coming up to a roundabout. A cyclist is signalling to turn right. What should you do? Overtake on the right. Give a warning with your horn. Signal the cyclist to move across. Give the cyclist plenty of room. Give the cyclist plenty of room. When are anti-lock brakes, ABS, most effective? When you keep pumping the foot brake to prevent skidding. When you brake normally but grip the steering wheel tightly. When you brake promptly and firmly until you've stopped. When you apply the hand brake to reduce the stopping distance. When you brake promptly and firmly until you've stopped. What does this road marking mean? Traffic should use the hard shoulder. The road bends to the left. Overtaking traffic should move back to the left. It's safe to overtake. Overtaking traffic should move back to the left. How can you use your vehicle's engine to control your speed? By changing to a lower gear. By selecting reverse gear by changing to a higher gear, by selecting neutral, by changing to a lower gear. What does this sign mean? Hump bridge, 
Humps in the road. Entrance to tunnel. Soft verges. Humps in the road. What colour are the reflective studs between a motorway and its slip road? Amber, white, green, red. Green. You see a pedestrian waiting at a zebra crossing. What should you normally do? Go on quickly before they step onto the crossing. Stop before you reach the zigzag lines and let them cross. Stop to let them cross and wait patiently. Ignore them as they're still on the pavement. Stop to let them cross and wait patiently. How should you dispose of a used vehicle battery? Bury it in your garden. Put it in the dustbin. Take it to a local authority site. Leave it on wasteland. Take it to a local authority site. You're driving towards this left-hand bend. What dangers should you be aware of? A vehicle overtaking you. No white lines in the centre of the road. No sign to warn you of the bend. Pedestrians walking towards you. Pedestrians walking towards you. What's the main benefit of driving a four-wheel drive vehicle? Improved grip on the road. Lower fuel consumption. Shorter stopping distances. Improved passenger comfort. Improved grip on the road. How should you overtake horse riders? Drive up close and overtake as soon as possible. Speed isn't important, but allow plenty of room. Use your horn just once to warn them. Drive slowly and leave plenty of room. Drive slowly and leave plenty of room. What does the law require you to keep in good condition? Gears. Transmission. Door locks. Seat belts. Seat belts. You wish to tow a trailer. Where would you find the maximum nose weight allowed on your vehicle's tow hitch? In the vehicle handbook. In the highway code. In your vehicle registration certificate. In your license documents. In the vehicle handbook. You're approaching a red light at a puffin crossing. Pedestrians are on the crossing. When will the red light change? When you start to edge forward onto the crossing. When the pedestrians have cleared the crossing. When the pedestrians push the button on the far side of the crossing. When a driver from the opposite direction reaches the crossing. When the pedestrians have cleared the crossing. You're on a three-lane motorway. A red cross is showing above the hard shoulder and mandatory speed limits above all other lanes. What does this mean? The hard shoulder can be used as a rest area if you feel tired. The hard shoulder is for emergency or breakdown use only. The hard shoulder can be used as a normal running lane. The hard shoulder has a speed limit of 50 miles per hour. The hard shoulder is for emergency or breakdown use only. What's the right-hand lane used for on a three-lane motorway? Emergency vehicles only. Overtaking. Vehicles towing trailers. Coaches only. Overtaking. What should you do when moving off from behind a parked car? Give a signal after moving off. 
Check both interior and exterior mirrors. Look around after moving off. Use the exterior mirrors only. Check both interior and exterior mirrors. You think the driver of the vehicle in front has forgotten to cancel their right indicator. What should you do? Flash your lights to alert the driver. Sound your horn before overtaking. Overtake on the left if there's room. Stay behind and don't overtake. Stay behind and don't overtake. You're travelling along a motorway and feel tired. Where should you stop to rest? On the hard shoulder. At the nearest service area. On a slip road. On the central reservation. At the nearest service area. You wish to turn right ahead. Why should you take up the correct position in good time? To allow other drivers to pull out in front of you. To give a better view into the road that you're joining. To help other road users know what you intend to do. To allow drivers to pass you on the right. To help other road users know what you intend to do. You're following a long vehicle approaching a crossroads. The driver signals right but moves close to the left-hand curb. What should you do? Warn the driver about the wrong signal. Wait behind the long vehicle. Report the driver to the police. Overtake on the right-hand side. Wait behind the long vehicle. What should you do if your anti-lock brakes, ABS, warning light, stays on? Check the brake fluid level. Check the foot brake free play. Check that the handbrake is released. Have the brakes checked immediately. Have the brakes checked immediately. What does tailgating mean? Using the rear door of a hatchback car? Reversing into a parking space, following another vehicle too closely, driving with rear fog lights on. Following another vehicle too closely, you're driving on the motorway in windy conditions. What should you do as you pass a high-sided vehicle? Increase your speed. Be wary of a sudden gust. Drive alongside very closely. Expect normal conditions. Be wary of a sudden gust. What should you do as you approach this lorry? Slow down and be prepared to wait. Make the lorry wait for you. Flash your lights at the lorry. Move to the right-hand side of the road. Slow down and be prepared to wait. You take some cough medicine given to you by a friend. What should you do before driving? Ask your friend if taking the medicine affected their driving. Drink some strong coffee one hour before driving. Check the label to see if the medicine will affect your driving. Drive a short distance to see if the medicine is affecting your driving. Check the label to see if the medicine will affect your driving.